Oh, all right guys, the day has finally come that tomorrow is my half marathon race that I've been training for the past month. If you're not subscribed to my channel or you haven't seen any of my previous videos, I decided to run a half marathon um, simply because I needed like a goal end point to just some type of like physical activity and training and I've never really pushed myself with my running really dedicate time and effort and training to it so I only had one month to train for this half marathon and it is literally tomorrow I'm a little bit nervous I think in general I really think that I'm gonna be okay in the marathon the most I've run was uh, 10 miles and a half marathon is 13 point one it's just gonna be a very chill day today but I do have to go downtown and pick up my running packet which has my little number bib so yeah we got to do that and then I got to get some food and then tomorrow is the big day but unfortunately the run is at literally 6 a.m. in the morning which is insane I've never run that early I am super excited but I'm also a little bit nervous so that's what's happening Okay guys, I got my number. Can you see? Oh, it's this way. And this is my little wristband. And I also got a free participant t-shirt. Um, and I'm like, this is crazy. It's like official, like this is actually happening. But I'm not running the whole marathon. And now I'm kind of like, damn, I should have just pushed myself to run it. But it's not healthy. Like people train for a whole marathon I think maybe like three months, maybe four months. I don't know, like a long time. And I've only trained for one month. So I'm not gonna go crazy. I'm not gonna go for crazy finish time, speed. I just wanna complete it. And I will be proud of myself, the fact that I just ran through that. Meeting my family to get some pho. I've been really obsessed with Vietnamese food lately and specifically like pho, which if you don't know, is a type of Vietnamese soup. I just got home from having some food with my family and I wanted to just talk a little bit about what I've been wearing on my runs this entire month and what I will be wearing tomorrow on my official race day. I'm just so excited to say that today's video is sponsored by Lululemon. I mean, Lululemon. In the first stitch to the last detail, it's always been Lululemon's mission to create the best products and tools that will allow people to just feel like they can do anything. I'm wearing a matching set, the line sports bra, and it has a very simple back. It's also a little bit longer here. And then I'm wearing the Wonder Under High Waisted Lux Stream Leggings. I absolutely love these. I feel like not a lot of people know about these. They don't cut into my waist because this just kind of lays flat. I also have it just like a simple black and this sports bra is reversible. And for colder days, one thing that has been really keeping me warm, Rulu Run Half Zip. I just really love this print, but they come in many different colors. It has a extra zipper here. It has this extra cover for your hands. And these come in really, really handy when it's super cold outside. I really like wearing hats when I'm running. Fast and free run hat is perfect. Perfect. It's very breathable. It's also sweat wicking. The material is super, super light. And also another accessory that I've been loving is the Daily Stride Mid Crew Socks. I have the fluorescent green ones here. The material of these, it is 
not too thick, not too thin. I got some of my family members some stuff from Lululemon for the holidays just because it's like one of those products that once you have them, they become such a staple of your day-to-day -day routine. If you guys want to check out any of the products that I talked about or anything on the Lululemon website for the holidays, then you can go to lululemon.com. I want to thank Lululemon so much for sponsoring today's video. And now I'm going to go take a hot, relaxing bath and then we're going to make dinner. So um, see you there. God, I feel so relaxed that I just took a bath. Oh my God, it was incredible. And I lit up the little candles. It was great because it really helped me kind of just calm my nerves. I feel like I've been a little nervous every minute of today a little bit, just like feeling that I have something coming. I'm gonna try to like hydrate as much as possible. So actually, I'm gonna grab Grab this. It always helps me drink and maybe put some like lime or lemon in it because it always helps me drink more water if I add some type of flavor to it. Actually go time I gotta leave um, I'm still like trying to just wake up but I've got my number on and I'm just drinking my tea to like warm up a little bit but yeah we're ready to go so I'll see you guys at the race
was good. Uh, my legs really, really hurt right now. And I need a massage. But overall, it was good. I didn't die. Um, yeah. Show us the it. metal. And now I'm gonna go eat a fat burger. <laughs> and? And that's it. How did you feel, you know? I like, felt good, you know, I walked a couple times. Yeah, of course. You know, I, I had to like chill because sometimes I started running too fast because there's always people like passing you and you feel like you're behind. Damn. But you just have to stay, you know, composed within yourself. My baby, my baby did that shit, babe. guys I know that I didn't really update you um, after my run but as you saw I took a good and very necessary nap earlier felt amazing and then I've just kind of been cleaning the house took a bath before I took a nap <laughs> and it's gonna be an early night for both of us because Yoni woke up with me at uh, like five. five in the morning <laughs> So we're definitely gonna go to bed like soon. Wait, not soon, sorry. It's like one, it's like 2 p.m. But you know what I mean. We're gonna go to bed probably like eight. <laughs> but the marathon, the half marathon was good. I'm really proud of myself. I feel like I conquered it the way that I wanted to. Obviously I could have run faster and kind of gone, gone harder. You can always be better. But I think for the fact that I've only been training for like literally one month, a little bit less than one month actually. Overall, great experience and uh, we're gonna go get some food right now. We actually haven't eaten yet. <laughs> <laughs>